Hi, by Tommy Van Gogh. I hope you're doing marvelously well. Today, July the 20th, 2017, I received the Ultimate Kit made by IA from Tedes, located in Milan, Italy. The microphones are coming in this elegant case. I go to open it to show you the products. The first thing first attracted my attention is the documentation package. It contains text packs and the manuals. Opening it, you find the limited warranty certificate and the required technical instructions for the proper use of the included devices. But now, let me show you the content. Here's the power cable. I'm located in Belgium, so it is delivered with an IEC female plug at one side and a Shuka plug to the other one. Then I got this nice red handbag with the AEA logo stamped on it. They give also four sticky silicon feet to be applied underneath the TRP preamp to avoid to scratch the shelf where the preamp will be located. Here is the low voltage power supply cable which serves to connect the external power supply unit to the TRP preamplifier. Let's go to take the power supply unit, first getting rid of the purple bag that surrounds it in order to protect it. As you can see, this device is quite essential, massive, robust and really well finished. It has an IEC female socket with fuse for the main power and three parallel 7 ports outlets TIN45329. Now we still have the TRP preamp and the two microphones R92. Let's get the first one out of the flat case to see how it is. I'm considering I'm the first one in Italy and Belgium to have them, because some funny episodes have occurred I do think to be the very first in Europe. Let's carefully get rid of the protective bag. And here it is, carefully crafted and quite a lightweight. Here is the front side where the logo is located, and here the back side where the serial number is stamped. The elastic suspension is made by strong rubber rings and the support comes with a larger diameter. The day after I bought a couple of reducing bushing to be able to mount both microphones on my stance type. The joint is pivoting on two axes, one is free and the other one is delivered quite tight and needs a flat screwdriver. The cable goes directly into the body of the mic and the opposite led is terminated to a standard 3 ports XLR male plug. Just to check everything, let's see also the second microphone. So I get it out of the plastic envelope. Et voilà, same crafting care as his brother. Here the front side, and here the back side. Notice the serial number is consecutive. With the current light angle, the inner ribbon reveals itself to the camera. Now it's the moment of the TRP preamplifier, which lies into a foam bay placed in the suitcase cover, and here it is. From left to right we got in channel A the phase switch, the gain switch, the potentiometer for the level and high pass filter switch. Same sequence for the channel B plus the LED power indicator. The gain rotary switch has 11 positions and switches from plus 6 to plus 63 dBs. The potentiometer adjusts from minus infinity to plus 21 dBs. High pass filter and phase switches are normal push buttons. The construction is very well made, well painted and rocked. On the back side there are the connectors. From left to right we find the power supply socket a 7 poles female DIN, the channel B, unbalanced output socket, balanced output plug, balanced output plug and balanced input socket. The same connectors sequence is applied to the channel A. On the top cover of the TRP preamp there is a drawing that shows in a simplified way the signal path and where the main controls aligned on the front panel are applied. Here you can see the devices connected together. The TRP high gain low noise preamplifier, the power supply unit, one of the kings of this video, the AEA R92 ribbon microphone. Last but not least, the whole voiceover of this video was made using one of the microphones you have seen here. Thanks for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe.